ವಂದೆ ಗುರುಪದ್ವಂದ ಭಕ್ತಬಿಂದು ಸಮನ್ವಿತ ಶ್ರೀ ಚೈತನ್ಯ ಪ್ರಭು ವಂದೆ ನಿತ್ಯನಂದ ಸಹೋದಿತ ಶ್ರೀನಂದನಂದನ ವಂದೆ ರಾಧಿಕಾ ಚರಣೋದಯ ಗೋಪೀಜನ ಸಮಯುಕ್ತ ಬಿಂದಾವನ ಮನೋಹರ ವಾಂಛಾಕಲ್ಪತರು ವೈಶ್ಯಕಿ ಪಾಸಿಂಧು ಬಿಭಚ ಪತಿತಂ ಪಾವುನೆಭ್ಯ ವೈಷ್ಣವಿಭ್ಯೋ ನಮೋ ನಮಃ ಮೂಕಂ ಕರೋತಿ ವಾಚಾಲಂ ಪಂಗುಂ ಲಂಘೈತಿ ಗಿರಿ ಜತ್ಕಿ ಪಾತಮಹಂಗ ಬಂದಿ ಪರಮಾನಂದ ಮಾಧವ ಬೃಂದಾವೈ ತುಳಸಿದೇವ್ ವೈ ಪಿಯಾ ವೈ ಕೇಶವ ಸ್ವಚ್ಛಕ್ತಿ ಪದೇ ದೇವಿ ಸತ್ವತ್ವೈ ನಮೋ ನಮಃ ನಾರಾಯಣ ನಮಸ್ಕೃತ ನರುಂಜೈವ ನರೋತ್ತಮ ದೇವಿಂ ಸರಸ್ವತಿ ವ್ಯಾಸ ತಥೋ ಜಯೋ ಮುದೀರ ಸಂಕೀರ್ತನೆ ಕೃಷ್ಣ ಕಥೋಪದೇಶ ಗೌರೀಯ ಪಾತ್ರ ಪ್ರಕಾಶನೆ ಸದಾನುರಕ್ತ ಗುರು ಭಕ್ತಿ ಯುಕ್ತ ಭಕ್ತಿ ಪ್ರಮೋದಾಕ್ಷ ಜಗೋದ್ವರು ಧೈಯ ಸದಾ ಪರಿಭವಗ್ನಮಿಷ್ಟದೂಹಂ ತೀರ್ಥಾಸ್ಪದ ಶಿವಭಿರಂಚನು ತಂ ಶರಣ್ಯ ಭೀತಾತ್ಯಹಂ ಪನುತಪಾಲ್ಭವಾಧಿಪೂತ ವಂದೇ ಮಹಾಪುರುಷತೆ ಚರಣಾರವಿಂದ ಯತ್ಪಾದಪಲ್ಲವನ ಖಚಂದಮನಿ ಛಟಾಯ ವಿಸ್ಫುರಜೀತ ಕಿಮಿ ಗಭೂಷ್ವಾದರ್ಶಿ ಪೂರ್ಣಾನುರಾಗರ ಸಸಾಗರ ಸಾರಮೂರ್ತಿ ಸಾರಾಧಿ ಕಾಮಯಿ ಕದಾ ಕಿಂ ಶ್ರೀಕೃಷ್ಣ ಚೈತನ್ಯ ಪ್ರಭು ನಿತ್ಯನಂದ ಶ್ರೀಯಾದೈತಗದಾಧರ ಶಿವ ಸದೀ ಗೌರಭಕ್ತವಿಂದ ಶ್ರೀಕೃಷ್ಣ ಚೈತನ್ಯ ಪ್ರಭು ನಿತ್ಯನಂದ ಶ್ರೀಯಾದೈತಗದಾಧರ ಶಿವ ಸದೀ ಗೌರಭಕ್ತವಿಂದ ಹರೇ ಕೃಷ್ಣ ಹರೇ ಕೃಷ್ಣ 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 ಹರೇ 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 ರಾಮ ಹರೇ ರಾಮ 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 ಹರೇ ಹರೇ ಅಜಾನುಲಂಬಿತ ಭುಜೌ ಕನಕ ಬುಧಾತ ಸಂಕೀರ್ತನೈ ಕಪಿತರು ಕಮಲಾಯತಾಕ್ಷ ವಿಶಾಂಬರೌ ದ್ವಿಜವರೌ ಜುಗಧರ್ಮ ಪಾಲೋ ವಂದೇ ಜಗತ್ಪ್ರಿಯಕರು ಕರುಣಾಹುತಾರು ಹರೇ ಕೃಷ್ಣ ಹರೇ ಕೃಷ್ಣ 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 ಹರೇ 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 ರಾಮ ಹರೇ ರಾಮ 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 ಹರೇ ಹರೇ ನಮ ಗಂಗೆ ತವ ಪಾದ ಪಂಕಜ ಸುರಾಸುರೈರ್ವಂದಿತೋ ದಿವ್ಯರೂಪ ಭುಕ್ತಿ ಮುಕ್ತಿ ದಾಸಿ ಭಾವಾನುರೂಪೇನ್ನ ಸದಾ ನರನ ಗಂಗಾತರಂಗರಮಣೀಯ ಜಟಾಕಲಾಪ ಗೌರೀ ನಿರಂತರ ವಿಭುಷಿ ತ್ವಾಮ ಭಾಗ ನಾರಾಯಣ ಪ್ರಿಯ ಮನಂಗ ಮದಾಪಹಾರ ವರಾನಸಿಪುರಪತಿ ಭಜ ವೀಶ್ವನಾಥ ಬಾಗೀಶಜುಷ್ಯ ಬದನೆ ಲಕ್ಷ್ಮೀರ್ಜಸ್ ಚ ವಕ್ಷಸಿ ಜಸ್ಯಾಸ್ತಿ ಹೃದಯ ಸಂಬೀದ ಸಿಂಗಮಹಂ ಭಜೆ ಹರೇ ಕೃಷ್ಣ ಹರೇ ಕೃಷ್ಣ 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 ಹರೇ 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 ರಾಮ ಹರೇ ರಾಮ 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 ಹರೇ ಹರೇ ಜತ್ಸೌಚ ನಿಶ್ಚಿತ ಶರೀರ ಪವರೋದಕೇಣ ತೀರ್ಥೇನ ವರ್ಧಿ ಅಧಿಕೃತ ಶಿವ ಶಿವಾಭೂತ್ 
धातुर मनह समल शैलो निसृष्ट वर्जम धय चिरम भगवद चरणारविंदम जत्सौच निश्रित सरित प्रवरद केण तीर्थेन मूर्धि अधिकृतेन शिव शिव अभूत धातुर मनह समल शैलो निष्ठिष्ट वर्जम वज्रम धये चीरम भगवत चरणारविंदम गौरीय गोष्ठीपति श्री शिल भक्ति सिद्धांत सरस्वती गोस्वामी ठाकुर परमांश जगदगुरु टोल परमांश जगदगुरु टोल दोज हु आर लाखिली इंटरेस्टेड टू नो द एब्सोल्यूट ट्रूथ they should be very careful about that if somebody really interested to know about the absolute truth maybe for long time he is hovering here and there and wandering round here and there if they are really interested to know the absolute truth they must be very careful about that because rest of the time of our life who can so when we can go away from this world who can say who who can say we can go away from this world when no surety so whatever time we have residue in our life without wasting even a fraction of second without wasting a fraction of second without wasting even a fraction of second wasting we must try to do actual hari bhajan by taking shelter unto a lotus feet of our sadguru sadguru main problem is that people are misguided people are misguided that is the main problem if they are at all interested to know some hari katha absolute hari katha still their society going to make them understand going to give some judgment in front of them if you are going to hear hari katha from that sadhu you are going to you know violate your gurudev because you are out of your society x mission y mission you have you have society gurudev mission if you are going to hear that hari katha you can miss this way they are going to cheat common people they are going to cheat people and foolish people they are also going to understand that okay really if we are going to hear harikatha from the real source then we are going to dis- going to be disconnected from our x mission y mission they are thinking that way like idiot people well this way people are day by day going away from the absolute truth and uh, no way no way out for them so baba speaking we must hear hari katha from a right source if we have no scope to hear hari katha from right source better we can stop hearing we can go reading chaitanya bhagavata chaitanya jay is okay still by reading chaitanya bhagavata chaitanya charitamrita jay bhagavata dharma we can get the association of sato indirectly Though we know direct association is also very important, but what to do? Something is better than nothing. So this way we see <clears throat> the sloka I started with going to glorify Supreme Lord Bhagwan Parat Parakleshwar Sri Krishna. <coughs> what are coming out from the lotus feet of bhagwan ganga you know shankar bhagwan going to going to accept that water on his on his own head and become a source of mangal shiva ha shiva abhut shiva shankar become a source of mangal by by catching the water on his head by holding holding the water on head and 
Sankar Bhagavan always going to meditate on the lotus feet of Bhagavan Sri Krishna, Nandanan Sri Krishna. And he who is going to always meditate that lotus feet, surely all different kind of anartha, everything, you know, Bajra, I like a thunderbolt. If a Bajra, if I am going to throw, if I am going to throw a Bajra, then the Bajra can, you know, do any, you know, Bajra can break even hills and mountains. Bajra, how oh, powerful. Similarly, any kalmas, any dirty thing there inside our heart, anartha, kama, everything, kama, krodha, everything, it can get destroyed and stand. And our Bhagavad Gita Mahaparana is going to advise us always and every time it is our duty to meditate that lotus feet. I mean, not to get disconnected from that lotus feet. Always we should be in touch with the lotus feet. We must remember. Abhishyati Krishna Padara Vindayar Khinoti Avadrani Chasantanoti Shatasasuddin Paramatta Bhakti Gyanan Chavigyana Viraga Yuktam. Abhishyati, we should not forget. Ashadhak. Ashadhak means who is going to step into Shadan Bhakti. Who is going to step into sadhana bhakti at least? Sadhana kriya not. I am not speaking about sadhana kriya. After sadhana kriya, somebody is going to step into sadhana bhakti. For them, it is a, it is a, you know the advice by Sri Prabhupada. They should get direct association of pure Guru Vishnu, if at all available. If not. Then big problem. Something is better than nothing. Then don't go. So a sadhak, for a sadhak it is very important to get the association of pure Guru Vaishnav, Krishna Tattva Bhid, very elevated Vaishnav. And by hearing Harikatha from the lotus mouth of that Guru Vaishnav, we can get absolute mangal. which is not possible by worshiping Bhagavan life after life. If we go on worshiping Bhagavan, not some devotees are there, I can, I can indicate you personally. They are very much interested to worship this, that, Ganga, I'm going to take bath in Ganga, this, that, but they are not interested to hear Harikatha. They are not going to participate in this satsanga. It is written, Papa speaking, that with material brain, because Kanishta Adhikari having some mixing idea, Kanishta Adhikari men have no clear idea, na? they have no respect for Guru Vaishnava. Somehow, with some faith, they are going to worship deities. But Papa speaking, with, uh, with some material idea, if they are going to worship Bhagavan life after life, still they can, cannot get that much facility what they can get by pure Shadu association and by hearing Harikatha from them. Because merciful Guru Vaishnav, see causeless mercy, they are so, see Guru Vaishnav, by the help of Harikatha, they are going to express their Baba. Because their Harikatha is not devoid of Baba. All their speech, every syllable, every word is full of Baba. So through Harikatha, when they are going to express their Baba, that Baba can touch the heart of so-called devotees who are sitting, even material people, are, you know, they are coming to hear Harikatha. Even if you are going to take darshan of Vigraha, Prabhupada speaking, even for darshan we are going here and there, still that Vigraha out of causeless mercy not going to give us that much kipa which is possible to get from pure Guru Vishnu through their pure Harikatha. Bhagavan in Antojami, Bhagavan sitting inside the heart of everybody, it's okay. 
he is not going to speak with anybody vigraha if if that vigraha is real vigraha i mean established by pure devotee if one big one deity is installed by a authentic you know personality pure guru vishnu then it's okay but anyway by the request of that pure devotee pure vishnu bhagwan going to take seva in the form of deity not in the form of deity deity and bhagwan non different from each other it is his causeless mercy bhagwan not going to protest why you are going to Uh, do this that not speak mauno bigraha special kipa for us foolish people you know and who is there inside the inside our heart as antarjami and uh, super so he is also not going to talk with us so it is more practical to get in touch with pure guru vishnu at all if you can find some pure guru vishnu in our sampradaya you can get in touch otherwise is a situation is very 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 sensitive very dangerous in chaitanya charitamrita it is written shiksha guru ke to jani krishna swarup shiksha guru can be understood as कृष्ण स्वरूप अब कृष्ण अंत जामी भक्त श्रेष्ठ एक दुरूप शिक्षा गुरु के तो यानी कृष्ण स्वरूप अंतर्यामी भक्त श्रेष्ठ ए दुरूप जीवे साक्षात नहीं ताते चैत्य गुरु रूपे डायरेक्टली यू कैन नॉट फील भगवान इज देयर बट भगवान इज देयर एज अ चैत्य गुरु जीवे साक्षात नहीं नॉट डायरेक्टली यू कैन नॉट फाइन you can you have no power to trace out jive sakshat nahi tate guru chaitya rupe chaitya guru in the form of chaitya guru shiksha guru han krishna mahanto swarup and shiksha guru can come in our life in a mahanti guru rupe antarjami ishwarer ei riti hoy this is the system laid down by bhagwan not going to speak to you but going to express everything inside your heart pal ishwar er ki pale shoy to jahare sei to ishwar tatto bujhi bare pare he can understand ishwar tatto who is going to enjoy kripa ab bhagwan sei sei ishwar tatto jani bare pare ईश्वर ईश्वर की पाले है तो जा सेम थिंग गोपीनाथ आचार्य वांटेड टू स्पीक इन फ्रंट ऑफ सार्वभौम भट्टाचार्य हू वाज नॉन नॉट इन लाइन विथ चैतन्य महापू प्रीवियसली बिकॉज यू वाज मायावादी यू वाज प्लेइंग ए लीला अब मायावादी एनीवे सो गोपीनाथ आचार्य टोल्ड दैट व्हेन ईश्वर की पा यू कैन एंजॉय देन यू कैन अंडरस्टैंड द फुल ईश्वर तत्व यू कैन अंडरस्टैंड and whenever you are going to meet with one pure devotee to hear harikatha from him that is also a guidance by bhagwan balram by your personal effort you are not going to get pure sadhu in your life tulsi das ji maharaj also speaking also in bhagavatam it is written satsang prapate pungir bahuvir sukriti purva sanchite satsang prapate pungir बहुवीर सुकृति पूर्व संचित है नॉट दैट ऑटोमेटिकली दे कैन गेट इट इज एन अरेंजमेंट इफ एट ऑल वी आर गोइंग टू मीट विथ सदगुरु सद वैष्णव देन इट इज ऑल्सो अरेंजमेंट तुलसीदास जी महाराज ऑल्सो स्पीकिंग बिन गुरु भवनिधि तरई न कोई राम की पा बिनु सुलभ न स्वी बिन गुरु भवनिधि तरई न कोई विदाउट गुरु नो बडी कैन cross over this material ocean or at all if you are going to get sadguru then it is the arrangement by ramchandra i mean in our case we can say baldajma <coughs> so though we know the vigraha bhagwan sachidananda mai but with us he cannot exchange view <coughs> 
because our consciousness is not our consciousness is not up to that level so that he can bhagwan can draw like ragunandan acharya small big pro all we can know <coughs> talk with bhagwan directly <coughs> this way bhagwan bigra and bhagwan is non different from each other we know and in course of traveling this material world 14 world somehow guru krishna prasad by the kripa of guru krishna we can get bhakti lata bij brahmand bhamite kono bhagwan jeev guru krishna prasad e pai bhakti lata bij main problem is there topa speaking we are going to follow blind parampara that is the main problem that is the chronic disease all over the world we are interested to follow blind parampara who can speak about that all siddhanta vichara pahupa in in front of public if we are going to express this kind of secret siddhanta vichara in front of public i mean all the bichar of prabhupa then we can get some evolution in our life but the main problem people they are now is bias you know biasness they have some biasness and some group going to convince them that if you are going to hear harikatha from this source then you are going to lose your guru kripa that is the main problem they are going to purposely they are purposely motivated it is they are making some plan and program and they are going to preach that if you hear from this source that source then you can lose your guru kripa because he is not in our in our society explanation why mission that's why you can lose everything but it is not the case basically people have no idea about guru parampara bhagavat parampara you go and you know and try to understand people are less interested to know the fact that that's why they believe them and they are being cheated what we can do <coughs> what we can we can give so many example that a pure sadhu cannot be confined with a group within a group is not possible even in a material world one scientist world class scientist we cannot say is from india he is from uh, russia is we cannot say he cannot be confined within this range it's not possible whereas what to speak about chaitanya mahaprabhu what to speak about haridas uh, you know rup sanatan popa bhakti mayur tagore they like to classify they like to make some politics and they like to make some politics and like to deprive people they like to cheat people of course they can get punishment for that after you know before leaving body or after leaving body, they can get anyway it is sure but anyway now they are going to cheat so common people they are foolish enough so foolish they are going to avoid hearing the absolute truth that's why this way if they go on doing bhajan for infinite period i can give guarantee they cannot come out successful absolute is absolute one absolute sadhu absolute hari katha it is you cannot you know you cannot say it is under our control under our this society that society this mod that mod it is not possible but they are anyway going to understand they are going to believe it <coughs> popa speaking if in a row chain wise if in a row chain wise some blind people going to proceed you know they are going to some place if one of them i mean the first man if going to fall down in a ditch then all other man they are going to fall down because they are they are they are, you know they catch their chain they are going to catch each other pova speaking pova speaking this is the condition of this material world guru parampara hari katha bhagavat katha preaching all you know this kind of condition none of them going to understand even common sense is not there what to speak about dibbagyan 
I am not speaking about Dibba Gyan. General knowledge, general Gyan is not there. Baba speaking, they cannot even, they cannot understand, they cannot, they cannot, you know, think. They cannot think, they cannot calculate. They are unable to understand this point. They should try their best so that like foolish people, they need not jump into ditch like other men. They should try, Baba speaking, they should at least think. Baba speaking, at least they, they should think, think about this point. That at least I need not uh, you know, run and jump into a ditch like the all other blind parampara, what they are doing. Baba speaking in this world, most of the people, they are, in the, you know, they are busy with eating, sleeping, enjoying, you know, man, woman, they are enjoying each other. Fear, ahar, nidda, vai, maithunancho, samannam, etat, pashubi, naranam, gano, visesho, adiko, naranam, gane, no, hina, pashubi, shaman. <coughs> they are going to think, are in our, in our X mission, Y mission, everybody is doing this. So how, how it can be wrong? So I should also follow them. Eh? I should also follow them this way. They are in, in a, no, one kind of infatuation and they are not going to take risks. They cannot understand that if I try to know about the absolute truth from heart, Balabhya Maharaj surely can guide me. They are not going to think. They are going to follow their blind parampara. Those who are busy with Boga or Taga, either enjoyment or detachment, a flow going on. They are getting contamination of their heart, you know, because they are going to follow them, they are going to get the association. They are always going to... <coughs> Many times I told, if I am going to follow a fallen soul, Many times I told before, if I am if <coughs> if I am going to follow a fallen soul as my idealism, then what I can expect in my life? <coughs> what I can expect in my life? If I am going to follow a fallen soul as my idealism, what we can expect? Uh, I can expect if I follow that preacher or that acharya this way. Then we are we are hundred percent going to hell. No, nobody can. This way, Pollard Maharaj already wanted to speak the same thing. Not a vidu who swartha gatim he vishnum dura sayaji vahir artama inaha andha yathande ruponiya mana steyopi steyopi ishatantra murudam nivadya. Nate vidu swart gotim hi vishnu dura sayaje bahira orthoman andha yathandai ruponi yamanaha steyopi mishatantra murudam nibadhya Nate vidu swart gotim hi vishnu they cannot guide you perfectly because they are already contaminated they are fallen <coughs> how they can guide you their absolute interest is <coughs> absolute interest of their life is missing. Their interest is money, position, love, puja, position. Absolute interest in their life is missing. Not a viduhu, not a viduhu, swartha gatimi vishnu, dura sayaji vihirato. They have a different kind of annavilas inside their heart. And their mind always going outside. <coughs> their mind always going outside. To travel, move around, to play in the field of five enjoyment. Five basic enjoyment. Sabdos, Parso, Rupa, They are traveling outside. Dura, Saya, Jeevu, Their attention is not there. Their attention is not there. 
for their absolute truth. So dura saya je bahir arthmanin, they are going outside. They are not, they are not interested to find out the absolute truth of their life. Just like a blind parampara, if you fool, if you follow, it is one kind of prejudicial idea. Somebody can say, "Well, I am from this society. Why should I go there?" Eh? I am from this society. Why should I go there to Hari Katha? This is foolishness. <coughs> We should not speak that way. Like Bhagwan is Bhagwan is absolute, and if real Hari Katha, it is also absolute. And the Sadhu who is speaking this Hari Katha also absolute. So absolute, uh, you know. There should not be. You should not have this kind of prejudicial conception. Absolute is absolute. If I am going to find Hari Katha from the lotus mouth of Sila Bhakti Vidanta Bhavanu Sima, surely I can go. I cannot say he is from that society. That society, I cannot say like idiot. I cannot say because Hari Katha is absolute. He is absolute. This way, eh? it's like greatest people. Like political game, they are making such this kind of game. I am going to cheat whole world. Let them do what I can do. Whom I can convince? It's impossible. They have some biasness. Anyway, Bhagavad Bhakta. Those who are going to enlist, those who are going to enlist their name in the diary of Hari Bhajan. They should not think that way. <coughs> like the case of that Brahman, who is coming from Guwahati, Prag Jadishpur. He used to worship Kamakha Ma previously. Out of causeless mercy, Kamakha Ma was very much interested to give this mantra, the Sakhar mantra, is very important mantra. To that Brahman, and she advised, she advised him to go on chanting, not to stop this chanting. Go on, and this way, up to now we know by discussing everything. <coughs> now, by the advice of Kashi Vishwanath, <coughs> Kashi Vishwanath came in dream of that Brahman. <coughs> He was in. very confusing state he cannot understand where to go how to go how to do bhajan what is the utility of this mantra because guru was not there only see, he got mantra from devi and devi is also not mantra adhishtati devata <coughs> he is not the in charge of that mantra anyway giving that mantra anyway that mantra protecting And anyway, this mantra is going to protect that Brahman up to now. When, by the advice of Kashi Vishwanath, going to reach Vrindavan, ultimately from Mathura, I told Vishram Gadi he took bath. Finally, going to reach, you know, Vrindavan Kashi Gadi. There also, from long distance, he is going to hear one very nice, you know, tune, but there is crying. Somebody as if, as if somebody crying. He was very much interested to trace out the spot. I mean the man from where this you know painful crying tune coming. He wanted to. Finally, he was successful to reach that spot from where the you know that you know tune coming sweet uh, sweet tune. He could discover one Gopakumar. He thought in first hand by preliminary darshan. He thought that is uh, that my mantra devota. I mean Madan Gopal. But after some time, he could realize no, it's not Ma you know Madan Gopal, but uh, you know is one Gopakumar. Very nice. So finally. He was very much happy to see and uh, to trace out this, you know, Gopakumar, and he could realize the Gopakumar is Antaryami. He can realize everything. 
especially Gopakumar went on speaking about uh, about his case history. I mean, what happened before? I mean, when he was there in Guwahati after taking up to now, everything is known to Gopakumar. So Gopakumar Antaryami can speak anything. So, <clears throat> Gopakumar could realize everything when going to open the eyes because he was, it was not, uh, he was not crying actually, he was doing Nam Sankirtan. Actually, he was doing Nam Sankirtan very painfully uh, with some uh, feeling of separation and from distant place, from long distance. It was uh, like a, a crying tune. It was not actually crying. Actually, he was doing Sankirtan now. Now, that Brahman going to pay Dandavat to Gopakumar and Gopakumar going to open eyes and could realize what is the case with that, you know, Brahman. He could understand he came out of this Nikunja, inside Nikunja, he was doing Sankirtan. Out of Nikunja, now Gopakumar coming out. And by watching that Brahman fall down on ground, paying prostrate Dandavada and Nama, he wanted to help him to get up and, and uh, he was very much interested to give him embrace. He was embracing him. So, this way, this way, almost everything is successful because that Brahman now very happy. He could realize that Gopakuma is not ordinary man, is a very exalted devotee. At the same time, he knowing everything about what happened in my life from right from the beginning. So also it is a point why Gopakuma started speaking all in details and wanted to give him a warm hospitality. Hospitality means he is not Grihastha, not going to get some chapati, this uh, water, asana, not that. Hospitality means it is Brajadam, it is Brajadam, and Gopakuma is Brajavasi, yes, at the same time. Uh, is Gopakuma because he love Gomata also like Krishna. So by speaking with that Brahman, very sweet speak, you know, sweet, you know, he wanted to discuss some point cordially, he wanted to embrace him cordially, and this is hospitality. Hospitality doesn't mean he's going to uh, give one room to stay night and uh, give some chapati paramana, not that. This is hospitality. This is also sweet speech. Because according to the culture of Brajavasi, he is going to give him some warm, you know, hospitality. So this way, and also, uh, he was very much interested to convince, because he was, Gopakumar is a very elevated devotee. He could realize the painful situation of that Brahman. So out of causeless mercy, he wanted to represent himself in front of him in such a way so that Brahman can believe him 100%. You cannot say that a Gupagumar is very much interested to collect La Puja Patishta. Not that. Somebody can pass remark, then why Gupagumar going to represent himself in front of you, in front of that Brahman in a very, uh, very uh, positive way, very nicely. So that, that the Brahman can believe him. The secret reason behind it, if by watching the painful situation of that Brahman right from the beginning, Gopakumar was thinking, if I am fail, if I am going to fail to convince that Brahman, that Brahman cannot find any solution in his life. If I am failure to convince that Brahman that you have come to a right place, then I cannot find any solution for that Brahman. Anyway, some, some doubt and suspicion can be there. You know, 
this way gopakumar was not at all interested to collect la puja pratishtha don't think that way because out of causeless mercy gopakumar wanted to support give some support to that brahman that was the reason causeless mercy and one uh, another very important thing if i am going to take diksha from sila bhakti pramod purigishi maharaj and if i have 50% faith in gurudev then i cannot get any result any result eh? some result like in not perfect result we should understand that gurudev is a concentrated form of karuna of bhagwan ghani bhutoru very very concentrated form of karuna sigaura karuna shakti vigraha namaskriti we speak we speak now sometime sigo eh sigaura karuna shakti vigraha namaskriti we speak so gurudev is the concentrated eh karuna vigraha of bhagwan and coming in front of us just like a human being in the form of guru vishnu they are coming but they have no self interest they always want to they want they always want to find some solution for those wounded soul they come here appear janasya krishnad vimukasya daivad adharma silasya sudukkitasya anugruhayeho charanti nunam bhutani bhavyani janard bhagavat sri जनश कृष्णाद विमुख दैवाद अधर्मशील से सुदुखित अनुग्रहाये हो चरती नून भूता भाव्या जनार्दन से इन दिस भागवत श्लोका इट इज बीट शो दैट गुरु विष्णु ऑफ ट्रावलिंग इन दिस मेटेरियल वर्ल्ड कमिंग इन दिस मेटेरियल वर्ल्ड फॉर द इमेंसिपेशन ऑफ दिस बॉन्डेड सोल दे हैव नो सेल्फ इंटरेस्ट they want to express karuna towards those bonded soul they like to deliver them that is all anyway that gopakumar could realize is a mathur vipra mathur vipra mean he is wandering here and there without any information about how to meet with madan gopal because mantra given is madan gopal and you know, you know टेन अक्षर मंत्र तो आदिष्टा देवता ऑफ टेन सिलेबल मंत्र एंड दस अक्षर मंत्र इस मदन गोपाल और क्या श्रीमद मदन गोपाल उपास कंच समागतम श्रीमद मदन गोपाल उपास कंच समागतम समागतम निश्चित कुंजाद उत्थप नत्यालिंग नवेशयत ही कुड रियालाइज वे अंतर्जान the one devotee of madan gopal coming from long distance oh is a very painful situation up to now he could not realize up to now he could not realize the the great mantra he has received from kamakha devi anyway he is antarjami coming out of this kunj of the kunja and wanted to embrace him that much i told you and it is a comment written by sanatan goswami then why mathur vipro i mean this brahman after wandering here and there finally going to meet with gopakuma what is the reason sanatan goswami reason sanatan goswami was speaking it must be so that radharani she wanted to help him otherwise how possible just like the case there just like the case what happened there in gaya in varanasi elyabad what why not happening so yes but now shatam is speaking it is sure that he is going to enjoy keep up radharani without the arrangement of radharani it is um, impossible for that brahman to meet with this meet with this you know sadguru brahman kumar 
I mean Gopakumar, Radharani, all different kind of kripa, Radharani can bestow on us, usually is the case. So in the form of Guru, today Radharani is going to send Gopakumar, surely, surely Radharani is going to send Gopakumar in front of that Brahman as Guru. Otherwise, why he is going to meet with such, such a great exalted devotee like Gopakumar? What can be reason? I already told Atha Tittameva Shantosho Vishajutpadanayasa Kinchitena Nu Bhutam Jadabanjayama Susasmitam. I already told Gopakumar wanted to give him warm welcome or hospitality. After that, out of his causeless mercy, to, con to convince that Gopakumar, to convince that Brahman, to convince that Brahman, Gopakumar went on speaking all about what happened in his life. With some smiling face, he went, uh, uh, started speaking all what happened in his life. So that, that the Brahman can believe at least. And because if Brahman going to express some doubt, again he can go to some other place. Because from the very beginning it is happening. So going here, there, here, there, not getting satisfaction, not getting ple pleasure of mind, nothing. So anyway, this is possible. So, that Brahman could realize Buddhya Gopu Kumaram Tam Labdhe Atma Priyam Muda Vishashto Agatayan Tashmin Shavritvam Brahmano Akhilam That Brahman also, that Brahman also was very much convinced, that Brahman also very much convinced by that Gopu Kumar. And he wanted to accept Gopakumar as the topmost benefactor of his life. Mangal, who can give Mangal? He could believe. Buddha, Buddha, after understanding, after realizing, Buddha, Gopakumaram, Tam, Labdhi, Atma, Priyam, Madha. He is a dear man, near and dear man, whom I can believe 100%. Vishwasto, he is a reliable person. So, Brahman also went on speaking about uh, all in details about different kind of Sangha what he got in his life in Gaya, Varanasi, Eliyavad. And uh, Brahman was very much, you know, feeling very pain inside her and finally going to speak what? Sha karpanna midancha su pasrita pasritaha punarabhaprit tam sarabhagavaram natya swattamam Gopanandan. You know, Brahman could realize as a Srihit. Srihit means without any self-interest, who is going to, without any self-interest, if somebody is going to find some Mangal in my life, it's called Srihit. Treatment? No interest. Only like Mangal. Brahman, that Gopakumar, after getting, meeting with that Gopakumar and you know, after some dealings with full enjoyment, he could realize that he is a, you know, perfect, you know, perfect guide in my life. And he went on speaking that I went here, there. After that, realizing that Gopakumari Antaryami can understand everything, past, present and future, and he is topmost sadhu by realizing, out of cause, out of, you know, humbleness, very hum humbleness, hmm, uh, due respect and humbleness, he went on speaking, Brahman went on speaking, what? I went to, you know, here and there, all different kind of association I got in my life, you know. I went to uh, Kashi, Varanasi at the bank of Ganga. 
I went to Allahabad here and there. Some of them advised me. Some of them wanted to advise me this way, whereas some other group wanted to advise me this way. So up to now, I have no solution in my life. I couldn't get a solution. Now I am in confusing condition. Shrutya bahu vidam. साध्यम साधन ततस्तत प्राप्यम कृत्वंचो निर्णय न किंचित छक्कते दे आर एडवाइजिंग मी सो मेनी आई वेंट टू काशी आई वेंट टू एलेवा सो मेनी दे आर गोइंग टू एडवाइज मी दिस वे दैट वे पर एनी वे आई एम नॉट कन्विंस्ड आई एम इन कन्फ्यूशन बिकॉज सम बॉडी स्पीकिंग दिस वे सम बॉडी स्पीकिंग दैट वे सो Gopu Kumar going to speak all the painful situation of his life. Buddhya Gopu Kumaram, tam labdevatma priyam muda, bishasto akatayam tasmin, shavritam brahmano akilam, shakar panya midancha so, pasri taha punarabhrit, tam sarvago varam matva. शतमं गोपनंदनम शिव अनुवाच श्रुत्या बहुविधम साध्यम साधन च ततस्तत प्राप्यम कृत्व निर्णत न किंचित शकते मैया आफ्टर हियरिंग सो मच एडवाइस फ्रॉम आफ्टर हियरिंग सो मच एडवाइस फ्रॉम डिफरेंट प्लेस I am in confusion still today. I cannot find out the absolute. I cannot understand the absolute duty. I cannot understand still today. What to do? I am in confusion. I mean, Brahman Kumar. I mean that Brahman man, and I mean that Brahman now gradually. I mean. the brahman now gradually want to submit unto all lotus feet of that gopakuma that is the position gradually is going to speak all about otherwise tatto if i like to if i like to put one question about tatta that's mean i want to know about the absolute truth so If I am going to put some question, Gita and Gita Bhagwan speaking, that Vidhi Pani Pate no Paripushna no Sevaya, Upadeshan Ti De Gyanam Gani no Stattva Darshina. So accordingly, Brahman Kumar also going to pay Dandava, going to glorify him as a pure sadhu. This way going to serve. So that Vidhi Pani Pate no Pani Pate no Prakishto is going to fall down on ground and on to the lotus feet of that. Gopakumar, the Tadvidhi Panipat Panipushno. He is going to put some question. Jacha Deva Gaya Kinchit Anu Tishtami Nittasha Tasha Peking Falam Tachu Katamak Karmo Vedmina. That Brahman speaking. This is my condition. I am traveling here and there, different places, Kasi, Varanasi. काशी वाराणसी इलाहाबाद हियर एंड देयर बात है नो आई एम इन कन्फ्यूशन सम ऑफ देम एडवाइजिंग इन दिस वे सम ऑफ देम दिस वे सो आई डोंट नो व्हाट टू डू सो सो व्हाट टू डू एंड आल्सो कामाख्या देवी मदर कामाख्या देवी सी Gave me one mantra, okay. But what is the result of that mantra? How to do bhajan of that mantra? I couldn't get from her. Jaccha deva gaya kinchit anustista me. Whatever sadhan bhajan, what I am trying my best, according to the advice of Devi Ma, that I am doing. But tasha picking phalam, tacha katamat. कर्म वेदमीन बाय द ऑर्डर ऑफ देवी वॉट एवर आई एम गोइंग टू डू 
by the order of devi whatever sadhan bhajan what i am trying my best what is the ultimate result of that that also i have i have no idea and what is the karma what is the meaning of that karma because mantra without understanding if i do some japa can get some fun. but to get the final result mantra adishtati devata seva <coughs> it is not sufficient because anyway go that brahman not going to develop any sambandha gyan from anybody but anyway mantra cannot go in when because mantra is very powerful that mantra is very powerful so cannot go in when so brahman speaking at per as per the order of kamakha devi what i am daily what i am doing what is the result of that and what i am doing and a mantra job and a what is the utility i don't know i know nothing about that that's why that brahman speaking tene dam bifalam janmu manvano kamaye mrtim i want to die i'm fed up only today i'm happy to meet with you but i i was really fed up tene dam bifalam janmu without uh, understanding sambandh gyan idhi i don't know what is bhajan only i'm chanting mantra so i'm really fed up fed up i'm traveling here and there so i like to die because without understanding mantra procedure because regarding mantra japa uh, there is so many thing five different kind of procedure you should follow to get success in mantra not that gurudev giving mantra you are going to chant not that while doing mantra there is very very secret thing it is very scientific what is that you will have to understand the meaning of that mantra first point second you will have to meditate unto the lotus feet of that mantra adishtati devata follow nash mani you will have to throw yourself unto the lotus feet of bhagwan you should believe that bhagwan can protect me i have no tension nothing follow bhagwan is my only object of my life this way four five types of things you should understand and after that if you are doing japa that japa can give you havoc success but most of the people like child they are doing mantra oh hi hi they are doing mantra they are not going to think that way so they are not getting any result and also our material mind is always very very you know chanchal always chanchal run here and there. so to get control over this material mind is really tough really tough but anyway no alternative anyway no alternative way we will have to get control over our mind by automatically not by force because without uh, getting any control over your over our mind bhajan cannot start but to do and you can watch your mind you can see you like to concentrate in jogabit sri mandir you like to think about your gurudev vaishnav you like to think about you know dama but you can discover that your mind is very very much frequent sometimes successful to do sometimes become chanchal scattered it is called scattered like the compass of the you know like that compass you know is going to get you know scattered always so that brahman want to die he is speaking all about his painful experience tene dam bifalam janmo manvano kamai mitim param jeevami kripaya shivayo ramadavasya cha <coughs> that is why this is my case history painful that's why i wanted to die but but i cannot die because by the mercy of madhav bindu madhav madhav and visheshwar 
विशेष बात वैष्णवानम जथा संभव आई लाइक टू डाई आई कैनॉट डाई बिकॉज बाय द मर्सी ऑफ माधव एंड बाय द मर्सी ऑफ विशेश्वर सम हाउ आई एम गोइंग टू मैनेज सम हाउ आई एम गोइंग टू मैनेज माई लाइफ एनी वे सम हाउ बाय दियर कॉज विज मर्सी टूडे आई एम गोइंग टू मीट विथ यू इज जस्ट लाइक माई इष्टा देव I can see my Ishta Devi in, inside you, Brahman speaking to Gopakumar. By their causeless mercy, I'm sure that today I'm going to meet with you, who is just like my Ishta Dev, Ishta Dev Sadhguru. I'm very happy. I'm feeling some pleasure of mine. very happy and brahman going to speak you are antarjami can read my heart past present future whatever so you are sarvagnya you are antarjami you are having very very merciful attitude dayalu and i am a fallen soul so you must deliver me You must deliver me, otherwise, in problem, big problem. So, jacha deva gaya kinchit anutista minitta sha tasha picking palam tachu katama ad karma vedmina te ne dam bifalam janmo manva na ha kamahi matmitim param jiva minik paya shiva yor madhavasya cha. तयोवात्राद्रो तयोर्वात्ताद्रो सर्वज्ञ दयालु तम सदेवत्प हृष्ट प्रसन्नस्मी कृपनम मां समुद्धरो नाउ इट इज अ वेरी पॉजिटिव पॉइंट आई मीन गोपकुमार कुड रियलाइज दैट ए ब्राह्मण दैट ब्राह्मण नाउ That Brahman now by the mercy of Madhav Bindu Madhav Madhav or Vishnat now could realize that my perceptor is this this Gopal Kumar he could realize and going to pray unto the lotus feet of that that Gopal Kumar very happy now Parikit Mara speaking. Now Parikit Mara speaking. Parikit Mara speaking. <coughs> Gopal Kumar, after hearing all the statement from the mouth of the Brahman, Parikit Mara speaking. <coughs> Nisham saadaram tasya bachanam sa bachintayat etasya kito kitvasya jata. पूर्णाथता किल निशम सादर तस्व वचन सचित कृतकृत्ता पूर्णाथता किल निशम सादर आफ्टर फुल विथ फुल एटेंशन विथ फुल एटेंशन आफ्टर हियरिंग You know everything. <coughs> After hearing all the statement of that Brahman very patiently, with with full patience, and that Gopal Kumar. <coughs> Gopaguma started thinking <coughs> that though that Brahman thinking all in vain, that Brahman thinking all in vain, I simply, a simply wastage of my, simply that Brahman 
he was thinking that simply wastage of mind wastage of time in my life that's why he wanted to die but gopakumar could realize oh well actually gopakumar could realize that brahman is almost successful kito kitartho very lucky nisham sadaram tasya vachanam sa vachintaya he started thinking that brahman is almost successful almost nisham sadaram tasya vachanam sa vachintaya etasya krito kitvasya jata purnarthata ki that brahman is almost uh, successful manorath purno or the desire of his mind going to be fulfilled very nice kevalam tat pad pankajo sakshat dikhav shishyate tat japi arhatvi na shakti kintu tannam kirtane kevalam तत्पदाबोज साक्षा दीक्षावशिष्वते तज्जी अर्हति ना शक्ति किंतु तन्नाम कीर्तने गोपकुमार स्पीकिंग दैट ब्राह्मण ऑलमोस्ट गोइंग टू बी सक्सेसफुल ऑलमोस्ट इज द बैंक ऑफ द सक्सेस ओनली द थिंग एक्सटर्नली he could not receive any diksha from him <clears throat> only he has to wait for the darshan of madan gopal this much oh he is successful only he will have to wait for that otherwise he is successful and if that brahman go on doing japa of that mantra a mantra is okay mantra is not bad is very powerful mantra but still gopakumar is thinking that sankirtan can help him it is more practical for that brahman to do sankirtan he should grow interest he should that brahman should grow interest in sankirtan sankirtan is more powerful निशम्य से परिचित वाचो निशम्य सादर तस्व वचन सचित कृतकृत्वश्यो जाता पूर्णाथता किल केवल तत्दाबोज साक्षा साक्षा दीक्षावशिष्य साक्षा हि वन वेरी इंपॉर्टेंट पॉइंट two meaning can be there if you read very slowly i mean kevalam tat padam bujo sakshat diksha vashishyate this way you can read or you can read another way kevalam tat padam bujo sakshat ikha vashishyate ikha mane darshan and dikha mean uh, to take mantra from guru both meaning you can get because anyway brahman only only got uh, no mantra the sakshan mantra not in details not in details so kevalam tat padam bojo sakshad diksha vasishvate kevalam tat padam bojo sakshad ikha vasishvate tajjapi arhati na shaktim kintu tan namo kirtane gopakumar speaking he day by day if he day by day he is going to concentrate in japa but with japa it is the rules because mahaprabhu already saw have shown to us with japa to naam sankirtana in sandarbha also in rasamrita sindhu also it is written krishna sanana vid kirtaneshu tan naam sankirtanam eva muksham it is written well all the naam because mantra is also oriented with naam and not so not a matter of joke so it is written 
that Krishna Sonana Vido Kirtaneshu Tan Nyama Sankirtana Meva Muksham. Nam Sankirtan is a man. Mahaprabhu, same thing, wanted to advise everybody. Tapan Mishra, here, there, wherever, wherever Mahaprabhu went. Yes, same. Nam Sankirtan Kalau Param Upai. Nam Sankirtan is the best procedure. So, uh, Gopal Kumar uh, thinking inside mind that almost that Brahman is successful. Oh, he is enjoying the keep of Madhav, enjoying the keep of Bhavani Devi. Eh? Bhavani? I mean, Sankar, Bhavo Bhavani, Vishwanath, Kasi Vishwanath, Kamaka, almost successful. Now, not a matter of joke, but still, he should increase his interest. He should increase his interest in Nam Sankita. That is the main point. Gopakumar thinking how to advise, how to advise that Brahman which way uh, so that can arrange the absolute success for that Brahman. Anyway, Radharani is going to send that Brahman in front of me. Otherwise, why he is going to come in front of me? After hovering so many, you know, uh, Wandering here and there. After that, Parikhit Maharaj speaking, actually it is the mind of that Gopakumar. Parikhit Maharaj speaking, but the mental and mentally Gopakumar thinking. Simand Madan Gopala Padam Bujapasanat Param Nama Sankirtano Prayat Banchati To Falapadat. What? Shemad Madana Gopala Padam Boja Pasanat Param Nama Sankirtano Prayat Banchati to Fala Pradat Gopakuma thinking, but uh, Parikima speaking, the, what is the conception of Gopakuma? Actually, it is the mood of Gopakuma. Gopakuma thinking, uh, I must advise this Brahman to do Nam Sankirtan because. Nam Sankirtan, uh, Nam Kirtan is a topmost sadhana. Nam Sankirtan Kalau Param Upai. So, Srimad Madanu Gopala Param Pasanat Param. If by mantra he can go on worshipping Bhagavan, that's okay. But, the topmost procedure of worship of Bhagavan is a Nam Sankirtan. No sadhan, no sadhan can be no sadhan can be compared with Nam Sankirtan. It is the best. It is the best. No Sankirtan. Because by doing Nam Sankirtan from heart with a feeling of separation. Painful heart. Nam Sankirtan can give success immediately. Nam Sankirtan with great care and love, with a feeling of separation, with great sincerity, with loveful attitude. If somebody is going to uh, do Nam Sankirtan, that Nam Sankirtan give result which is beyond your expectation. Banchadito Bhalkuranda. Which is beyond your expectation which is beyond your expectation, that can give. So why not? So this way, Gopakumar as a guru, because he already, that Brahman already want, you know, wanted to submit unto the Lord of Spirit. You saved me, already told. You are my perceptor. So, so Gopakumar thinking which way I can guide that, you know, Brahman, so that he can get success immediately. That's why, so, <clears throat> Nam Sankirtan is going to give advice because simply, because simply by mantra japa, because simply by mantra japa, one cannot get Braja Prem. Be careful. Only by chanting mantra, one cannot get Braja Prema, which is rare. 
without keval without you know without nam sankirtan if somebody going to do only chant mantra that bridge of bridge of prema cannot give or it is not possible to meet with it is not possible to meet with madan gopal dev or cannot get direct seva in brindavan golok vrindavan it is not possible of course you can put some argument maharaj mantra is not cheap yes of course not cheap mantra is okay and naam and mantra do almost externally same not internally also not externally also but the mantra mean is oriented with naam mantra na दीक्षा पुरस्चरण विधि अपेक्षा न करे आई लाइक टू टच दिस पॉइंट बट टुमोरो आई कैन क्लियरली स्पीक बिकॉज टाइम कैन नॉट प्रॉमिट दीक्षा पुरस्चरण विधि अपेक्षा न करे यू नीड नॉट टेक एनी दीक्षा पुरस्चरण नथिंग है ना नाम कीर्तन कैन गिव सक्सेस फॉलो but for bonded soul mantra is a must but just now you told yes i told but you should go deep into this you should go deep into this you know siddhanta vichar externally you can say all the same not though it is written in chaitanya chaitamrita diksha puraschcharan vidhi apekshana kare जीवा स्पर्शे आचंडाले उद्धारे इवन चांडाल फॉल इन सोल दे कैन बी डिलीवर्ड बाई नाम ओके राइट फॉलो ब स्टिल वी लर्न फ्रॉम आवर गुरु वर्ग एंड दोज आर गेट गेट एलिवेटेड लाइक जीव को से बात रूप को से बात दैट बॉन्डेड सोल नेचुरली वे बिग चांचल bonded soul naturally be big chanchal <clears throat> very chanchal their heart is not getting any stability anyhow so much chanchal to control that chanchal man to control that chanchal man one has to take diksha from gurudev because otherwise who can otherwise otherwise who can otherwise who can help mantra mean guru oriented mantra mean mantra diksha mean guru and you can mantra mean you will have to accept one sadguru who can give you know mantra which is very powerful all other people those who are going to take diksha from here and there <coughs> all other common people those who are going to take diksha from here and there here and there they cannot get success because their gurudev if not realize soul if their gurudev is not successful to get siddhi in that mantra try to understand if if my guru maharaj guru padmapada wrote one wrote one article is 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 mantra shakti in bengali i can discuss some day about it guru padpadma wrote guru ma speaking in my childhood in my boyhood i meet with one and uh, one you uh, know <coughs> case what is that case one very poisonous snake going to bite some some young man the man going to fall down are going to die almost almost dead somehow <coughs> somehow somebody <coughs> going to call one master of mantra of snack going to call immediately he is going to call and then man running and coming and going to you know three c cell you know c cell c cell three three c cell 
Gurupatma was speaking in my in front of my eyes. I have seen what is the power of mantra. Gurupatma was speaking that man uh, giving some mantra to that you know three cells, C C cell, and three C cell going to run, flying, and going to catch that snack. One is top in the head of the snack, and two in the cheeks of the snack. Two two three. You know, going to catch the snack. That three C cells, those three C cells going to catch the snack. One going to catch in the head, and another two and the two side of cheeks. <clears throat> and the snack, Guru Maharaj speaking, coming, bound to come. And the spot of his bite going to, you know, going to put mouth and going to. You know, all going to you know take out poison from the body. Guru Bhagwan is speaking. The article name of this article is Mantra Sakti. After that, I am not going into details because time cannot permit. Guru Maharaj is going to conclude that in material world, Guru Bhagwan is concluding that in material world, if this kind of mantra of ghost. Of snack so powerful. If this kind of mantra so powerful, material mantra. <laughs> so if this kind of mantra so powerful, uh, that is inconceivable. But one thing sure, if the man who is going to who is going to uh, speak that mantra to save that man. Surely he has received this mantra from some guru. Guru Padma speaking, without accepting mantra from a from a perfect guru. Perfect guru bin in our bhajan line we can say realize so. But in bhajan and uh, in material life, this kind of mantra they are going to do siddhi siddhi. I mean the man who is going to do this mantra. He has surely he has taken mantra from somebody who is successful to make siddhi of that mantra. Without siddhi of that mantra, without siddhi of that mantra, if somebody going to take mantra from a man who is not siddhi, he has not received any siddhi and mantra, he is not successful. Guru Padma was speaking that snack mantra or ghost mantra also available in market. You can go and buy and try to recite that mantra. It cannot work. It cannot work because you are not siddha. You have not received mantra from your from your that that particular mantra siddha guru. So you cannot get such. So if in so if in this material world, Guru Padma speaking, if in this material world one cannot get success. If not going to take mantra of ghost or snack from an authentic source, so what to speak about our mantra parampara? How you can get success? How you can? You must be over sanguine. Try to remember what I am speaking. Try to realize you must be over sanguine. You must be over sanguine that this guru you are going to accept is shad guru. Is flawless guru, is perfect guru. Bhakti Mantra is speaking. Better you can wait for some long time. Bhakti Mantra is speaking. Better, oh man, oh man, don't be busy with this point of accepting guru. Don't be busy. Better it is far better to wait for long time. You will have to depend upon the desire of Balaam. Don't be in hurry. Don't be in hurry to accept guru. Oh, I need guru. I can go there. Not that. Oh, so much money, so big society. Not that. Not that. This is not the procedure. You are following actually this kind of procedure. Oh, I need guru. You are going. Uh, you are going where you can get status, position, glamour. You are going to get. You are foolish and idiot number one. You don't understand. If this material mantra of snack and ghost not going to give success, if I am not going to depend upon authentic guru, what to speak about that in a mantra guru? 
or the Bhagavad Parampara Guru. If they are not successful, if that mantra is not successful in your life, if that mantra, you know, what, what you are going to take, accept from your Guru, if he himself is not successful to make this mantra siddha in his life, how he can give mangal to you? How he can arrange mangal? He is not going to get, get mangal in his life. How he can get? So, it is very important. It is very important. So, we must depend upon, we must pray. Bhakti Manta was speaking. We must pray unto the lotus feet of Nithananda to get Sadguru. We must pray unto the lotus feet of Nithananda to get Sadguru. Surely he can help us. If we are sincere, without any duplicity, 100% then surely Balaji Maharaj can help us to get Guru. After getting Guru, it is your, your, it is your duty it is your duty to submit yourself unto a lotus feet of that Guru. Submission 100%. And Sadguru can give you mantra which is full of birja. Birja actually is a meaning, English means palm. But a birja, it should be full of birja. I already told you can remember that three things are prohibited. Three things are prohibited. One, you cannot give your daughter to a man who is not man, not woman. In between, you cannot give your daughter, you can you cannot give your daughter to a you know such a candidate who is neither man nor woman, because the life of your daughter can spoil. First point. Second, you should not arrange to uh, to to give you know to uh, you cannot arrange bija shit in a field which is full of sand. You cannot put bija, you cannot put bija seed in a, in a field which is full of sand. Third, first point I told you, second point I told Third, third point, you should not give mantra to a useless candidate. You should not give mantra to a useless candidate. Similarly, I would say, it is strictly prohibited to accept mantra from a useless candidate. Useless in the cell, you are going to uh, discover the glamour position of that guru. You are not going to, you have no power, you don't understand. You are cheated. You are going to think about glamour position, respect everything. But you don't know, Popat wanted to depend upon Srila Gaur Kishore Babaji Maharaj. No position, no rank, no nothing there. External view. That time I can speak this point at the time of Abir, I know Abir Bhaktiti of Sela Prabhupada. But it's one kind of evolution actually. How possible? Yes, who is the topmost pandit is going to accept one guru externally, whom you can discover not educated. How is possible? So. Gaudisar Baba Jumaya is a Sadguru, Paramahansa Sadguru, 100% in Bhagavad Parampara, Bhagavad Parampara surely, 100% because he is a Nam Siddha, he is a Siddha Mahatma. Gaudisar Baba Ji Maharaj is going to give some mantra to Prabhupada, he himself is Siddha in mantra. So what wrong in it? So, this way, one has to wait, one has to wait, because if we become chanchal, then they can meet with Asad Guru, Ravish Guru, Useless Guru, there is a Siddhanta, we are not. So, and the meaning of mantra, why I wanted to clarify this point, that Nam Sankita is more practical than Mantra Japa. Because without Nam Sankirtan, one cannot get Bhaja Prema. 
Vajaprema cannot get. Can get Bhagavan, okay, but get meet with Bhagavan and get something. But they cannot get direct seva also. Though externally mantra and naam almost same, but still Bhagavan naam not going to depend upon anything. For mantra, you, you need to take bath, you need to sit in a proper place, consider in your mind, very mere, you know. About Harinam, there is no such uh, hard and fast rules. Nam, Nam, Akari, Bahuda, Nijo Sarvabhakti, Nijo Sarvabhakti, hear me, this mantra. Nam, Nam, Akari, Bahuda, Nijo Sarvabhakti, Stattar, Pita, Niyamita, Svona, Nino, Kalo, Itak, Dishita, Bhakiva, Bhagavan, Mamapi, Duddaiva, Midrishan, Mihajani, Nanu, Raga. Bhagavan Chaitanya Mahaprabhu speaking. All your full you know, power you are putting in Nam Sankirtan. So without Nam Sankirtan, one cannot get Brajapema or cannot get you know, direct seva. So now mantra is useless. No. Mantra is not useless. Mantra is okay. But the point I wanted to elaborate. What is the point? that you should take mantra from a very, very perfect source, who himself is having an, a perfect mantra, I mean Siddha mantra. Otherwise, if you are going to depend upon some ordinary man and a fallen soul as guru, then that mantra cannot work in your life, cannot give any facility. Anyway, for Chanchal Jivatma, mantra is a must. That's why Raghunath Das Gusei also told, also in different Shastra, there is document that Raghunath Das also told, Guru Goshte Goshtalai Shubhagane Bhusuragane Shamantre Shinamani. This mantra, it's already spoken. Also, what do you mean by mantra? What is the meaning of mantra? Mantra, any mantra you can get, but Actual mantra, meaning of mantra means mananat tayati iti mantra. If you are going to concentrate in the mantra, it can deliver you. Deliver me can help you to cut material bondage and can help you to reach up to that level of consciousness where with full love, full mood is possible for you to do Nam Sankirtan. Don't think it a matter of joke. At present in the whole world, at present in the whole world, after Srila Paramahansa Siddhar Goswami Maharaj, after Srila Bhakti Pumapuri Goswami Maharaj, you know, such a sadhu rare. Bhakti Vala Tithya Goswami Maharaj also doing, he used to do Nam Sankirtan. Such sadhu rare, from who we can get, you know, this kind of Nam Sankirtan, really rare. Impossible almost. So, Mantra can help you to get out of bondage, not only that, but also Mantra can help you to grow your consciousness. Mantra can help you, not that Mantra is useless. Mantra is okay, you know. Because now Mantra Sarupoto there is no with, but still, by Sarup, Mantra, Naam, nothing, you know, you know non-different, but still, by Sankirtan, all your chanchal man, by, by your mantra japa, by your mantra japa, first of all, you will have to get control of, of your chanchal mind. It is also very important to understand, not to understand, to <coughs> grow. Grow mean, you know, Shamanda Gyan. One Shraddhavan, one Shraddhavan Sadak. Shraddha means Pilimani Shraddha. He believed in the Harikatha, Sadhu, Nam, Mantra, Dham. Okay. But still, one Shraddhavan Sadhu, one Sadhu who is having Shraddha, he should get in connection with Gurudev, 
who can help him to build up relationship build up mean already eternal relationship already there we all we all have eternal relationship with bhagwan but still gurudev can help us as a catalyst to grow our relationship with bang sambandha janiya after knowing sambandha i can do so to grow sambandha gyan it is also very important to get mantra mantra is not a matter of job sambandha you know it is very important so to grow sambandha with bhagwan to understand to discover our eternal is relationship with bhagwan it is very important to take diksha from a sadguru sadguru can help me to discover my relationship sambandha gyan with bhagwan and also by the help of mantra diksha guru shishya sambandha either relationship of shishya with disciple can be understood <coughs> you can remember i was speaking about uh, madhusudan baba you can go back long ago two months ago madhusudan das baba ji maharaj of surya kun eh whenever he wanted to approach siddha kishodas baba ji maharaj there in govardhan whenever he wanted to approach you know siddha uh, baba ji maharaj there in kamaban they wanted to refuse they wanted to speak the same thing you cannot speak your guru you don't know your guru name which parampara how i can no i cannot do so it is very vital point very important point guru shishya sambandha which parampara which line which way it should be realized because without guru kripa we i cannot fix up my life what mantra i got my guru path which rasa my guru maharaj have all automatically can flourish so anyway according to the quality of disciple i mean balla ji maharaj going to this by going to guide them those who are not sincere having some contamination of karma they are going to get karmi guru those who are contaminated with gyana not not full faith in bhakti they to get gani guru those who are not you know believe on ashtanga yoga yoga di ah is more practical we can get some power of yoga okay well they can get yogi guru but if we are going to reject if we are going to reject all these ways and going to depend upon bhakti by realizing bhakti is the only way then balaji maharaj can guide me according to my test and mood popat also speak in the same according to the mood and you know, sanskar one can get guru one can get guru popat speaking according to according to our previous sanskar we can meet with guru if my sanskar is not good i can get karmi guru gyani guru or shakta guru what do you karmi guru yogi guru this way it is very it is very important point that guru shishya the relationship between guru and shishya is very important because guru ki pa hi kevalam without guru ki pa we cannot make any progress in bhajan anyway without guru ki pa we cannot make any progress in our bhajan guru ki pa hi kevalam that is why according to the scriptural analysis and advice pancharatik vidhan here there diksha vidhi the procedure of diksha everything should be there should be there it is very important we should accept <clears throat> not that we cannot take no not that so that gopukumar he wanted to guide that he wanted to guide that brahman very perfect way because anyway there is no self self interest shimad madan gopal padam bujo pashanat param nam sankirtano prayad banchati to phal pradat beyond an expectation beyond imagination result 
Nam Sankirtan can give result. Okay. So, Gopagum are going to take decision. I can inspire, I can give inspiration to that Brahman to do Nam Sankirtan. Because he is almost in the gate of success. Almost is uh, just at the gate of success because his mantra is doing chapa, everything. And uh, only the darshan of Madan Gopal is waiting for him. No problem. Anyway, so <clears throat> after that, Gopaguma thinking, if that Brahman going to get taste and taste and taste, very taste by hearing all different Leela from me, all different Leela from me, if he is going to hear all different kind of Leela, Madan Gopal Leela, his faith can increase. Also, if he is going to, you know, believe in the Leela Sali, all the Leela spot, there is a place where Krishna done and Rasa Leela, this is Kaliya Daman Leela, this all different kind of Leela spot, if we can great, if we can grow our faith, it's more practical. So, so lila tallila stalo palinam, tallila stalo palinam, sradhya sandarsana darui, shampyadumanat. Nitaram kinchit nasti eva sadhanam. What can be more? What can be more beneficial for? What can be more beneficial for the Brahman? Well, if we can, if we can, or if we can grow faith in a lila sali and go on hearing all different lila of Madan Gupal and go on singing at Nam Sankirtan by singing Nam Sankirtan. Everything you can get. Everything complete. So, Nam Sankirtan is complete bhajan. Nothing more, nothing more special than that. Nam Sankirtan is the topmost. Nothing more special than that. No. A sadhan, Nam Sankirtan sadhan is topmost. That's why Mahaprabhu almost whole day used to do Sankirtan. Bad present, time cannot permit us, situation cannot permit us, all different jealousy, fighting. Where we can dance? Where we can dance? In public? Here? In the open street? <laughs> situation changing, na? This. Tallila stalo palinam shadhya sandarsana dadarai Shampadumanat nitaram kinchinyasti evo sadhanam. What can be more? What can be more beneficial for that? Shadak, I mean, for this Gopukumar. Hey, for that Brahman. Sanyato premukat. Sanyato. Sanyato premukat. Chasmat. Chatur Bargo Biram Bakat Tat Padab Jabusi Karad Anyat Shadhanam No Kinchana Gopakuma are going to think inside mind, all calculating how to guide that Brahman. Gopakuma are all thinking inside, this way I can guide him, this way, this is the best procedure. And Gopaguma now thinking that out of this upasana, out of this bhajan upasana, one can get prema, which is rare treasure. In front of that prema, all chotur bharga, dharma, artha, kam, mokha, all useless, all useless in front of this prema. So I can help that Brahman to attain prema. And automatically everything can be done. Prema is there. You can meet with the Bhagavan also. Not automatically. Sanyata prema kat chasmat chatur bargo chatur bargo biram bakat tatpada bhashi karad anyat 
Sadhanam na kinchan. This upasana is the topmost procedure in front of which all chatur barga, dharma, artha, kam, all useless. By this bhajan procedure, one can get control over Madan Gopal. Madan Gopal can be subjugated. Madan Gopal can come under the control of devotee by this bhajan procedure. Is very positive. So, this kind of bhajan procedure is one kind of magic spell, black magic or white magic, whatever you say, to get control over Madan Gopal. That's why no bhajan can be compared with this bhajan. And there is no, nothing extra can be there except this. So, I think this way I can, so I think this way I can guide that Brahman is more practical, as very nice man, as a, you know, Bajokumar already started speaking that Mathur, minded, Gopukumar is so experienced, Gopukumar can see past, present and future, that's why he is not going to make any mistake, in the first sight, First time when he saw the Brahman, or even when coming out of that, you know, you know, Kunja, first time when going to meet with that, then he could realize past, present, and future. That's why Gopakumar going to uh, going to speak. That is Mathur. Mathur is not an ordinary word, which is applicable for everything. I can discuss this point tomorrow. Anyway. Today, due to lack of time, I cannot proceed further. Excuse me. Today, I am bound to stop here. Excuse me. Jat Sauchani Srito Sarito Pavarod Kena Jat Sauchani Srito Sarit Pavarod Kena Tirthena Murdhi Adikritena Siva Siva Bhut Dhatur Manaha Samala Swailo Nisristo Vayu Bajiram Dhaechiram Bhagavat Charana Rabindam Banchakalpatur Sikipa Sindhu Vishu Patitanan Pavana Bhavishna Vyonam.